a group of queer best friends gather in Fire Island Pines for their annual week of love and laughter. As they discover the romance and pleasures of the iconic island, their bonds as a chosen family are pushed to the limit. In the new film, Fire Island. Take a look. I can't believe you talked me into this again. I come here, I just feel terminally alone. Oh, are you all right? It's fine. It happens all the time. Do you want some whiskey? It would help with your knees. You trust me, I'm a doctor. You think that if you're vulnerable for just one second, that it's all going to come crashing down. Oh my God, my baby's drowning! All you guys, you're like, all I have. We're family. That means something to me. What are we going to like hug and wrap this up? How does this end? Andrew, I want to start with you. As director, how much prep goes into living and enjoying Fire Island before you make this? Full disclosure, I had never been to Fire Island before yeah. getting the job. And then once I got the job, I was like, oh, I should go to Fire <laughs> Island. And so I made it my business to go as much as I could. You know, we went on scouts, but then I also went on a few research trips. Hey. Um, yeah, it's so cool to be able to, to make a movie in such a historic queer place, you know, um, to be a part of that legacy. Like, I was so psyched. For people who don't know what happens with this beautiful scenery, this party, this craziness, walk us through this story. Bowen, why don't we start with you? Sure. Um, it is a story about uh, a chosen family that goes every year together to sort of experience, as you said, the beauty of the place and the social sort of rituals of it. And um, it's just beautifully mapped onto Pride and Prejudice, this perennial love story that Joel has um, rendered. Right. Now they get into trouble. They get into fun. There's like so many funny scenes in this. Joel, tell me about this story and adapting this kind of classic rom-com story into this world. Yeah, I mean, the, the inspiration came from many summers spent on Fire Island with Bowen. The first summer that we ever went, I read Pride and Prejudice. And it really, for me, just the way in which Jane Austen sort of talks about class and specifically talks about the ways in which people communicate across class lines, that felt so relevant to what we were experiencing on the island. And so I think like there is this idea of like, who do gay men become when there's no one around to oppress us? Like, who, how do we oppress each other? And that was really sort of the crux of, of what I wanted to get to while also, you know, jokes and love and and skin. You know? <laughs> it's funny you mentioned skin. I, I was I was thinking about how uh, there's like an idea of like currency and how you size people up, you know, jobs abs there's a funny line about all this stuff right what to you let's go to you conrad what is what is your currency and what you like like what exactly is it kindness, kindness. <laughs> that's yeah, good for me here because i see this movie and i see some abs and i go i'm gonna stick with the kind one i'm gonna go for the kind <laughs> now james you meet this group on the island right mm -hmm. you're this cool fun loving doctor tell me a little bit about the role and what happens to you in this story I think for Charlie, this is, I think it's an awakening for him. He discovers that like queerness and queer community doesn't have to be like a trap that you're caught in. And you can find people where you don't have to be like performing the ideal version of yourself as a queer person. You can just be fully embracing the uniqueness of your experience and what you bring to the queer community. And now, Matt, let's talk about your character and uh, this world that you jump into as well. What was it like for you? Joel sort of wrote the character with me in mind, which both felt like a drag and also a huge opportunity <laughs> and really fun because the character is a thirsty little mess. I think that by the end of it, I was better for having done the movie. Fire Island is streaming now on Hulu.